Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're diving into the much-anticipated next-gen upgrade for Fallout 4 on Xbox Series XS, which unfortunately has hit a snag. If you're excited about switching to the new quality mode, you might want to hold off. Let's explore what's happening. Fallout 4 recently received a next-gen update promising enhanced gameplay with new quality and performance modes. This update was supposed to introduce not just better graphics, but also additional content including three new quests and some exciting Enclave-themed gear. However, Xbox players have encountered a significant issue. The quality mode simply isn't working. Despite setting the game to quality mode, which should allow for ultra settings at 30 or 40 FPS, the game stubbornly remains in performance mode capped at 60 FPS. This is frustrating for many, especially when compared to PS5 users who are experiencing noticeable improvements in graphics in the quality setting. Moreover, there's a twist for PlayStation gamers as well. Those who grabbed Fallout 4 as part of the PS Plus collection can't access the game on PS5 without purchasing it again. Bethesda is aware of this and is working on a solution, but it's another hiccup in what was supposed to be a smooth rollout of the next-gen enhancements. The update also seems to have disrupted the modding community. Many mods, including the critical Fallout 4 script extender, are now incompatible with the updated version of the game. This issue mirrors problems seen previously with the Skyrim Anniversary Edition update, though the community managed to resolve those in time. To wrap this up, while the Fallout 4 next-gen update brought some exciting changes and additions, it also introduced a host of new problems for players on both Xbox and PlayStation. Xbox users in particular will need to wait for a fix to fully enjoy the new quality mode. Keep your eyes peeled for updates from Bethesda and I'll keep you posted as soon as we hear more. If you found this overview helpful, remember to hit that like button and subscribe for more updates on Fallout 4 and other gaming news. Drop a comment below if you've experienced these issues yourself or if you have any tips for fellow gamers navigating these updates. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.